Hello, my friends, and welcome. It is Wednesday, February 14th, 2018. It is drunk poker root time. It is beer time. It's happy Valentine's Day time, too. Do you celebrate the Valentines? I know I do. With delicious beer. No. I mean, you know, happy Valentine's Day to all your lovers and non-lovers out there. Even the haters. We love you, too. Um, for some inexplicable reason, I already opened my can. I literally I put it down on the table to get ready for the review, and I popped it open, and I'm like, oh, okay. I don't even know anymore, guys. It was a long day. But anyways, let's talk about the beer. From Woodhouse Brewing comes IPA beer. IPA beer, you say? Yes, I say. IPA beer. You know, I love a good IPA. And let's see if this is one. The Spiegeloo, the last remaining Spiegeloo in the Polk Manor. My word. It's the last one standing. It's my collective arts one, but it's my last one standing. So, American Pale Ale which is good for me, 6.0%, nice copper pour. You know, I'm, I've been tired lately, so I'm really trying to do the responsible thing and cut back my beers every night. So I'm doing one and done for a couple of nights here just to kind of foot off the gas a little there, buddy. Because, you know, you get a little intense after a while. I do anyways. I get really into my beer, and, you know, sometimes it's the only way I can communicate with the world. So, yeah, so I'm settling back a bit. Time for an IPA beer from Woodhouse Brewing. Cheers, guys. Happy Valentine's Day. Okay, getting like a nice toasty malt, some orange grapefruit. It smells good to me. Let's go. There still isn't anything better than the first sip of beer after a long day. Okay, so definitely this is an American style. Probably more West Coast if you're saying American style. Definitely maltier, big toasted biscuit malt body. Which I like, as a general rule. Like, I, I know this, don't get me wrong, I love my Nipahs. Nipa, But I also like West Coast styles. I'm a fan of the bitter. Who, who isn't a fan of the bitter on Valentine's Day? Bitter. But let's just, one more, hang on, I distracted myself. So it's a pretty classic and standard, on point, American style IPA. Grapefruit, orange, a little bit of pineapple, lingers with some bitter pine on the back end. It's nothing that's going to blow your socks off. It's not, you know, the latest Bellwoods release or something like that. This is what you call two style. And I have nothing but respect for brewers who give me a beer two style. Because if I don't know what the style is supposed to be, how am I ever supposed to understand the variance? So, excellent. Grab it. Take a look for it when you're actually at the LCBO. I'm a fan of their logo. Very simple. Very clean. Same with the beer. Clean and simple, and that's how I like them. So, happy Valentine's Day. Drink an IPA beer. Damn it. Why not have two? Because I'm only having one. I'm trying to be good here, folks. Enjoy your evening. I'm off tomorrow. I might have two tomorrow, because it's a whole day, but we'll see. Anyways, you guys, enjoy your evening. I'm going to go relax, and then I'm going to go to bed early. and a little self-care time for Polk. Cheers. IPA